Hello, my wellness warriors. We're going to talk about the universal energy and do a daily numerology reading with some cards. I'm intuitive healer, author, and warrior for your wellness, Trisha Gumberg. 2020. Clear vision. You don't need to be a numerologist to interpret that, right? Clear vision. Uh, those are your, you know, clear abilities. You might be experiencing those this year for the first time, or you might just now be considering working with those energies. That's what brought you to me. I can help you do that. Let's start with today's energy. We add the day, the month, and the year together to get the energy of today's date. It is the, what is today? Today's Friday. It is the 6th. We add 3 from the March, plus the 6 is 9, plus the 4 that is 2020, and we end up with a 4. Because we have to add it again. Six plus three is nine, plus four is 13. One plus three equals four. But there's also a trick about the nine. It's magical. You actually don't have to add it in if you know it's there. It's complicated. All right, let's, while I'm picking cards with my intuitive abilities, take some bottom of your belly breaths. See how that suggestion works for me too? We got the four energy building. Okay. This repeats our four about 2020. I had told you that the four is also about work. It's about approaching anything that you do, any goals you want to achieve with a step-by-step -step manner. And this is especially important for entrepreneurs. You got a big row. Your key here is that you're building, building. The building starts with what? A foundation. You don't just all of a sudden, bam, have a business. You have to build the foundation. I know I was about ready to throw in the towel <laughs> on my business after about mm, five years. And now I realize that I, you have to build a foundation. It takes, what, 10,000 hours in order for you to be considered an expert in something. That's working a business full time for like 10 years. <laughs> I think I figured that I did the math one time. Anyways, it's a long time. So don't quit. Whatever your goals are, whatever you're working on, big, small, going to college, I don't, redoing your house, building a business. Start with building a foundation. And it takes to build that strength. Oh, one of my friends compared me, she didn't know the name of the tree, uh, but it's kind of like an iceberg where you see like this much of the tree, but all underneath is this, all the roots just going, going, going. And then all of a sudden the tree one day just is like, bam. <laughs> yeah, that's me. Bam. Okay. Not in this half of the deck. I'm pulling a clarification card from Ask My Guides. Okay. To your bottom of your belly breaths. Tune in to me. Okay. Got a, this one. What do we got here? Mm, survival. Not, not surviving, striving. If we build on what we're doing, we can go beyond just surviving, but we can be thriving. Healer guides. Okay, if there's something, something that needs to be healed, um, uh, I should, I need to stop t thinking. Sorry.
there's some of you I just got that it is um, what we have survived is what's going to help us thrive. That through healing it is how we help others. And that's a long, talk about um, building a foundation and taking a long time um, to build on that. You know, we, we're we flipped sometimes and we say, oh, let's make um, lemonade out of lemons. And um, that seems, you know, simple and cute. Uh, but when we're, but when we feel like uh, uh, we survived something, in order to heal that and then build upon it and then allow ourselves to be vulnerable and share that with others, whew, that's that's a lot. I've, I'm in the process of doing that for myself. It's over a 33-year process. So this stuff, this gorgeous, yummy, um, wonderful stuff, it doesn't happen overnight. And uh, you're going to find healer guides, whatever, you're, there's so many more um, of us healers on the planet and we need so many more. If you need help, uh, you'll be able to find it, I guarantee. Okay, building. Start building that foundation. It just takes one teeny tiny little step. Just take one step. Okay, know that I love you. And until tomorrow or next time.